the, um, the boobs in and I used to have wear chicken cutlets but this was my first real bra that I started wearing after I got hor got on hormones and I think my mom bought it for me from Winners so there was that one um, oh, and then I'll get into like what I wear now so I wore that bra for like a really long time and then I got into okay then I uh, this is literally everyone's favorite oh shit close this is no joke everyone's favorite bra um it's this one <laughs> it's like all cute and stuff um so it would go like that but you know wearing this one was like really annoying because of the fact that it has the sides here um it's really like wiry so it just wasn't comfortable on me I wore these two interchangeably but I wore this one for a long long time before I got this one but these were like my first bras and I literally never wear them anymore so to what I wear today yeah I'm currently wearing a Victoria's Secret bra and these are all my boobs like you see this jiggle I could be a belly dancer <laughs> no I wouldn't um but yeah this is just a Victoria's Secret bra um legit boobs boobs and that's the one I'm wearing currently and like it's one of my favorite bras but when I'm not wearing that one I have this one from Victoria's Secret too my mom got this for me for Christmas and I think it's an A um but I'm a B now so get into this see how all this space do you see this glow up can we just take a moment to appreciate the amount of depth oh shit I sound like I'm talking about my new vagina that I don't have yet it's coming don't worry um but can we just appreciate the depth between like this one and this one like boobs these are like my bras I have more but these are just some that I wear and like I started wearing them but um I love this Victoria Secret one it's so comfy I love it as for my face, my face has totally changed since I started hormones. It has filled out quite a bit. I was very um, angular before and I feel like my face is a lot more round now, which I'm, I'm perfectly fine with because estrogen, thank you. Um, I'm going to insert like a picture or a video of me talking again, um, like here, whatever, I'll, I'll do it in iMovie, it's fine. Um, but so you guys can see the difference of today. Oh, actually, maybe I'll put a video from last August in. Should I do that? I'll put a, I'll put one of my videos from last August and then do, oh, yo, I think in those videos I was wearing a bun too. That's so funny. Um, but so you guys can see the changes in my face and it might not even look that noticeable, but it's definitely there. My face is a lot more round. There's a lot more puffiness to it. So there's that, which was like, yo, oh, yo, when my face started filling out, I just felt so much more comfortable with myself and I felt like I could look in the mirror and I just saw more me and that also really happened when my boobs started growing I felt a lot more comfortable with myself and I felt like I could I don't know I just there was like this confidence boost that I never experienced before um, so then we're gonna get into the body changes because a lot of people want to see those that's the butt le boute it's it's definitely grown quite a bit surprise me darling okay so so I'm just going to move back here so you guys can see kind of like the shape of my body now. I'm dead ass standing on a chair to do this. I'm getting more of like an hourglass shape, not really, but the waist come through waist. I'm not dancing. Okay, so that was my hormone update video. I hope you guys found it informative because, you know, I did show a lot thank you guys so much for watching and if you have any questions about breast growth or uh, fat redistribution in the face the hips or anything like that or just any questions in general about hormones feel free to ask me and i'd be happy to make a video for you till i see you next time stay sweet subscribe share and thank you for watching bye